Hi guys, what's up? Uh, Kenny here, and today we're going to be doing a squad update and just asking you guys a question. So, um, first of all, you'll see uh, up front we've got two new strikers, which is helping the chemistry a lot. We've got the 99 chemistry back, and I uh, can't, um, I've struggled to get 100 chemistry other than buying Ronaldo, which uh, obviously I haven't got the coins to do, but I have made a nice little bit of profit trading and buying these silvers. Uh, just for an example, I showed you that, uh, or I haven't showed you, but I bought a Forster the other day for, uh, I think it was 1.4k, I sold him for 5k, so a nice 3.6k profit there, guys, so, that profit, then I saw a Tudge from uh, Nottingham Forest, picked him up 300 coins, sold him 1900 coins, there's another 1.6k profit, and I also sold some Brazilian for 1900 coins, I picked up 300, so, it is proven, guys, that this silver method is working to uh, make the profit. So, uh, from the squad updates, as you'll see, I picked up Pepe there. I got him for about, I think I got him for about, uh, we'll check now. Got him for, where's, um, picked up Pepe for 8.6k, which was a bargain there. Normally goes uh, for around 12k or so, so, uh, Picked a nice little bargain here. Benzema, I just picked him up with my profit from overnight, which is helping the chemistry a lot. Picked him up for 6,100 coins. And Higuain picked him up for uh, 5,400 coins. So, as you can see, guys, picking up some bargains, making some profit, and it's really working for me. So, uh, the same same thing going on. It's Valdez, then Puyol. We've now got Pepe, who connects with Marcelo and Ramos. Still got Mascherano. Alexis Sanchez is letting the chemistry down a little bit because obviously his only connection is uh, the La Liga but with uh, the Barcelona connection with Mascherano then the reason I've got him, you're probably thinking who's that playing left mid <coughs> it's actually Nene of uh, PSG um, picked him up 1100 coins and look at his stats, they uh, really are quite good uh, 80 pace, 86 dribble, 81 shooting, 83 passing and he obviously has the good connection of the Brazilian with Kaká and Marcelo. It was my best option, guys, apart from buying a uh, Ronaldo. And I've got a Pedro, but he uh, drops my chemistry, so he's in the trade pile. Um, and my question to you, we'll have a look at my trade pile. My question to you, and buying a HD PVR, would that be a wise thing to do, guys? Uh, one of my mates is cutting me a good deal on it. Um, one of my mates cut me a good deal on his PVR, so I'm getting that. So I'm just wondering, uh, would you guys, would it make a much difference to uh, you guys watching my videos if I were to um, pick up a PVR? And also, uh, would you guys be interested, as you can see in my trade pile, if anyone wants to message me, I'm selling all these undercut in the market, cheaper than you can get on them on the market. He goes in centre forward position. He goes for about 8k, so there you can see. Falcao, same, goes for about 8k. That's it. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, guys. This, these were the market prices I checked last night. Cavalry goes for about 5k, so again, a Nilmar. I've overpriced him because I thought he was in a 4 1, 4 1, 2 1, 2, so uh, I'll have to drop his price. And I've got a Pedro that I'm selling for cheap. But if any of you uh, want to buy any of these players, uh, just hook Hook me up with a private message and I'll be happy to sort of deal uh, out with you. So uh, thanks for watching guys. If you could leave me some feedback on the PVR and if you want to buy any players. Thanks.